hello hello guys uh here we are again we have another mini pc i told you i have like 30 of these machines so i will have to repair them all one by one and they all come with different issues i hope i hope you have seen in one of my old videos uh repairing this machine they have different issues uh anyway let's go ahead without a waste of time let's uh repair this one let's see what's wrong step number one you know what to do right you connect the power okay the power has been connected let's press the power button no light repeat no light light no light okay as i was repairing this machine guys i'm um, i'm learning everything step by step now for sure i know that the 3.3 generated from here should be 3.3 volts here okay there's no 3.3 yeah there should be 5 volts there is no 5 volts there and here this is the main power line uh we should be getting 8 volts and then it's okay we do have the 12 volts but we are missing the main power rail of which uh, it's 8 volts coming from from the 12 volts okay let's remove the charger let's check for shots change your meter into continuity mode because now we are about to compare uh the 8 volts to ground check there our shots okay there's no shot check 3.3 no shot what about 5 volt no shot okay uh one more thing one more thing about these machines i want you to understand and be able to repair these machines anytime uh there is a mosfet there uh, it's a double mosfet there it is yeah normally that's double mosfet always goes wrong or if it's not that mosfet there's a chip controlling that mosfet so i do advise you guys to replace both the mosfet the double mosfet and the chip controlling that double mosfet let me show you okay let's um let's have a look this is the main 19 and uh, the, the main volt of which is the 12 volt it goes here passes through the current center and then the 12 volt will come straight into this double mosfet so this double mosfet uh, is capable of converting the 12 volts into 8 volts and the 8 volts goes here and then goes to the rest of this board but we are missing the 8 volts here we do have 12 volts there but here we are missing we are missing the 8 volts so to conclude okay okay let's go okay here we are this is a chip this chip here it always goes wrong if it's not if it's not this chip yeah the problem is coming from this double mosfet but to be safe we have to replace both this mosfet along i mean uh this chip along with this double mosfet so guys let's go ahead uh let's you know what i have a plan i have a nice plan i remember what i did uh to one of them of the boards and i tell you what i did 
okay so what i did was i connected ground to ground Go ground to ground and then after that set your dc power power supply to 8 volts okay yeah it's 8 volts what you do listen to me carefully uh be careful when, when you are doing this it's easy so there where you should be getting 8 volts you're gonna inject 8 volts using a dc bench power supply see what will happen <laughs> let's hope i won't uh <laughs> there won't be any fire so there i'm injecting eight volts because i did check for short and there was no short uh yeah. okay there's no short let's try to turn it on turning on and the fan is spinning see the fan was spinning just now so what we have to do it's easy guys let's be let's be smart let's connect this the an hdmi here and then let's go okay let's place eight volts there and then let's press the power button Hang on sorry i have to turn on the power supply then then on the machine okay the machine is on go to a microscope okay there it is american trend Amer okay american mega trends okay i hope you can see okay i think from here we should see a windows logo something something let's see okay there we go a uh, windows local this machine is working so there the only problem we have there i'm telling you let's go back move switch off okay uh guys the problem that we have there uh we are missing the um, eight volts of which is needed for a motherboard so what i'm gonna do we have to replace both uh, MOSFETs there, that's MOSFET, and then the chip controlling that MOSFET. Okay, 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 okay. Now I have to think. No, I have to think it's because I don't have another replacement uh, chip or MOSFET okay hold on let me try let me check okay sorry guys i don't have uh, a replacement mosfet and uh, a chip i'm really 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 sorry guys <laughs> i'm tired okay <clears throat> okay so now what do we do okay uh you have to replace the chip especially the chip not a mosfet as such but the chip always goes wrong it needs to be to be changed 